Tonight we're here at the historic Waldorf Astoria to give honour to Health Corps' angels, those who have so generously donated of their time, talents and finances in order to change the shape and the future of America's youth. On this Health Corps' sixth annual fundraising gala, co-founders Dr. Mehmet and Lisa Oz have welcomed a whole host of celebrities, including honoree Diane Sawyer and Matthew Modine. With heavenly cuisine dreamed up by Rocco De Spirito and a celestial performance by R&B artist Chantel, Healthcore has once again bestowed upon New York City a fundraising night to remember. It's Wednesday night, I'm feeling kind of out of my bones. Bon, 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 you see, I just got to heaven, and baby, there's a lot going on. We think all of our volunteers are angels because they are doing such good work. This gala is about celebrating those angels. Well, first of all, I want to thank Mehmet and Lisa and Michelle and Sean and the entire Health Corps team for your efforts to improve the health of our na nation's youth. Well, there's so many people in the world that are doing so many wonderful things to make the world a better place. So for Health Corps to recognize my small efforts is, is a great honor. To get an award with this group and with all of health, what Health Corps does is an enormous honor for me. In the work we do, I think there's only one review that counts. It's when you get a letter from someone at home who says, I watched what you did, I changed my life, and because of that, I'm alive. So thank you. The idea behind Health Corps really began at a talk for 90 students that my father gave to my graduating high school class. And it's come such a long way. We're in so many schools now doing such good. I don't think we realized how fast we would grow. It's taken on a life of its own, which for us was the whole goal in the first place. 32,000 students and the 64,000 friends and family whose lives you have changed. And that is tremendous. Food is sort of like either medicine or poison that you're going to put into your body. And I think that the more that you know about food, the more that it can be medicine. The childhood obesity tripling in the last 25 years, it has, we, we need to do something, we need to do it now. In order for us to reverse the trend, it's going to happen with the next generation. If I had a do-over in terms of parenting, it would be nutrition. But can you imagine if Health Corps had been around when I was raising them, uh, the different kind of job I would have done? It's an amazing cause. Everything about it is great. You're going into the school system. You're giving them the right tools in which they need in order to live a healthy life. The health is the core of a child's ability to learn, to study, to grow. So, reach in your pocket and invest in a child, which is invest in America, which is invest in any of tonight and the one in California we are raising over four million dollars so thank, thank you, you very, very much, much.